Welcome to the fifth game of Shipstorm Saturday. Uh, with three wins and one defeat, uh, we know that we have to win this game to have a chance to advance to the playoffs. Uh, now we're facing SSAM and they have a King George, a Cleveland and a Gert Yamada. We decide that uh, I should go to A, try and cap. Uh, while Mecca and Solana will be just north of B, uh, trying to shoot anything that they can. Um, again, they have a Cleveland, so the Raider uh, is my biggest concern. Um, so I need to try and position myself in A so that I can uh, run if they decide to come this way. Uh, RPF indicates B. Uh, we see smoke in front of the King George. Uh, and based on the shells, we see also that uh, Cleveland is in the smoke. Uh, while the DD is most likely continuing towards C. Uh, Mecca and Solana have been spotted, so uh, there is a fight going on there. I start capping A and uh, SSAM start capping C. And I'm a few seconds in front of that. Uh, see the Cleveland when I start moving towards B, so I shoot while I can to get him as low as possible. Uh, but my goal is to go into B to cap or at least prevent uh, the enemy from getting it. I try to keep an eye on the distance to the Cleveland to make sure he can't uh, raid on me. Uh, we see smoke from the DD again. And there's the radar. 8.7, so I move away from uh, the radar to up the other range. But the DD is also spotting me, so not the position, but he goes into smoke and I'm out of radar range, so I can repair. Then it uh, takes me again and I have to smoke myself up uh, and reverse into B to stop them capping it. Uh, first shooting into Cleveland. Since that is the only target uh, visible. Of course, since he's a Gadiamada, I don't have to fear uh, tops from him. Uh, but hopefully, I'm in a position where I can uh, spot uh, torpedoes um, for Salana and Mecca because uh, they can eat the torps and they will hurt. Uh, King George pops up, uh, so I uh, start firing at him, and I see one set of torps. And there is also the second set of torps. Uh, meanwhile, still continuing to shoot at uh, King George, uh, get the fire. See the Cleveland in the south, but uh, basically we're trying to uh, kill the King George here. And he's getting really low. The DD is still in B, uh, since I'm not able to cap it. And the King George is now sailing out of my range, I'm trying to get a few shots. Uh, and I get a fire actually. Cleveland pops out. I'm no longer in range of King George, so I leave B to uh, get a different position by an island to shoot at uh, Cleveland. Uh, meanwhile, they are now capping B. 
which makes it very important for us to actually get this kill. Undetected, and that is, of course, the destroyer. Uh, and now they have kept me, so we need kills. Solana dies, unfortunately, but she does have fire on Cleveland and it's going to burn to death. There's a new smoke in B, which is again the Garamada blocking uh, us from capping. But uh, the King George is visible and in range. Uh, so, after a bit of discussion, uh, instead of rushing the destroyer, uh, we decide to kill the King George's mecha uh, eight torps uh, and is very very low Lydia has left B and we managed to cap it and I managed to avoid the shells from the King George uh, we spot the Gadia and we both shoot to try and lower it down a bit. Uh, he disappears and we need to basically finish the King George now. Mecha is going to die any moment now, uh, but the King George is so low that uh, we need to take him down uh, with Mecha. Appears briefly, but uh, appears again, and we kill him. Meanwhile, the Guardian has been able to get a fire on Mecha, and he's dead. Uh, so, right now, it's uh, the two DDs left. Um, I have a better uh, rate of fire, but his shells hit hard and mind us. Um, my torps can, of course, hit him. But uh, his can't hit me, so I have an advantage there at least. Uh, I should also have a health advantage. So at this point, uh, since we also have two caps and they are one, it's our, or more accurately, my game to lose. Um, he, of course, of course needs to uh, go for the cap. Or kill me. Uh, we see each other and fire a bit before the island gets in the way. Um, since he does have to go for the cap and cannot run, uh, I slow down because I expect him to come up uh, on the left side of his island. He smokes up, um, so I reverse and see if I can maybe get some uh, torps out on him. Not sure exactly how long he intends to stay in the smoke or uh, if he's trying to trick me with it. So I'm just about ready to shoot the torps when uh, he does pop out and we start firing each other again. And he's down to about 2k health and I have. 9.6. So I send torps in case uh, he tries to turn in. Since the Garamada has very good uh, firing angles, he, he might do that. Uh, meanwhile, I turn around to get all my guns on him. And he pops out, and we start firing him. And here I basically cannot lose. Uh, as long as I don't miss, which I do there, but then I get him, uh, we win, and we win our fourth game, and with only one game remaining we know we have to win the last one as well to have any chance of going off to the playoffs. Um, but fourth win out of five.